Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is Gabe with Indigo Software, genuine Microsoft software for less. So in today's video, we're gonna be showing you guys how to run Windows 11 from your Mac using UTM virtual machines. Specifically, we're demonstrating this on my computer with the M2 processor. So this video is specifically for Apple Silicon chips. Now, before we get started with that, if you're interested in genuine Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software. We'll have links in the description box below. So without further ado, let's get started. So the first thing that we're gonna do is download and install UTM. We're gonna start on this webpage. We'll leave the link in the description box below. Now we got the DMG file here. We're gonna drag this over to applications and then we'll open our finder. We'll go to applications and we'll right click on UTM and press open. Now the next step is going to be to download the Windows 11 ARM ISO. So we need the ARM based ISO from the Windows 11 Insider Preview. We're gonna show you guys just how to do that. So we're gonna to need to start on this page. We'll leave the link in the description box below for you guys. Uh, I'm just gonna sign into my Microsoft account. You can click the Get Started Now button if, if you haven't already signed up for the Insider program. And so once you've finished with that, we're gonna be on this Windows 11 on ARM Insider Preview. We're gonna scroll down and select our edition. And then here we'll just select the latest build and we'll press confirm. We need to confirm the product language and press continue. And then here we can press download now. I actually already have it downloaded. The second method to downloading this would be to download Parallels Desktop. And Parallels Desktop will automatically download the uh, Windows 11 ARM64 with the click of a button. We have a video where we actually cover running Windows 11 with Parallels on these computers. You can click that right here. All right, so I have the ISO on my desktop. I'm gonna click over to create a new machine. Now we have an option here between virtualize and emulate. So which option you click is gonna depend on what CPU architecture you have and what the operating system is based on. Uh, for the purpose of the tutorial, we're on an ARM-based system installing an ARM-based ISO. So we're gonna click virtualize. Next, we're gonna press on Windows. We're gonna make sure these first two options are enabled. And then we're gonna click the browse button. This is where we're gonna pick our image file that we just downloaded. So we'll double click that and we'll press continue. We can leave the memory as default. You can change that if you want to. We'll leave this here as well. And I'm gonna go ahead and leave everything as it is and press save. All right, we're gonna press the play button to start the virtual machine. And here we are on the Windows 11 installation page. At this point, we just click next and the Windows 11 operating system setup is gonna take care of the rest. If you wanna see us go through this setup wizard, we usually speed it up anyways, but you can watch that parallels video. Again, put that right here. All right, so that's gonna do it for today's video. If you guys have any questions, drop those in the comment section below and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Again, if you're interested in genuine Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software. We'll have links in the description box below. So thanks for watching. We'll see you guys in the next video.